Chesapeake Lightcraft's Eastport nesting pram is a dinghy just a bit less than eight feet long. It packs down into a cube measuring about 57 inches by 48 inches for people who need a dinghy or a tender but don't have much room to store it. Like all nesting dinghies, you build the Eastport pram at normal length, then saw it in half between two special bulkheads. You'll need a stiff drink before you cut up your boat, and a crowd will gather to watch you. About 800 Eastport prams have been built all over the world, and it's immensely popular as a tender and sailing dinghy. The Eastport nesting pram shares the identical hull and construction process. This is a dinghy that's stable enough for anyone, and it rows beautifully. You can, and people do, row this dinghy all day long, full of gear, into the wind, and across busy harbors. Safety is important, especially for those of you who will be unable to move this 65-pound boat through the water without an internal combustion engine hung on the transom. Sailing versions have this nifty plug for the daggerboard trunk. Foam under the seats gives you loads of reserve flotation. As long as you remember to bring a bucket, you can bail out underway. We couldn't resist aping the famous old Boston Whaler advertisement. Yes, both parts float separately. You can even row them separately, though the boat works somewhat better when completely assembled. Payload is important in a dinghy too, and the Eastport Pram carries two adults easily, and their gear, up to a total of 375 pounds. Nesting the Eastport Pram takes a couple of minutes. The rear seat is removed and stored in the front half. The front half is held on with six stainless steel bolts through sturdy bulkheads with a rubber gasket in between. The bolts are glued in so you don't lose them. Large wing nuts make it easy to work fast, even if your hands are cold. Mine are. This is a pretty raw December day in Maryland. Every day. pram is a lot of fun to sail. The standing lug rig sets up in a minute or two, while efficient foils contribute to inspired sailing qualities. I've sailed bigger boats and faster boats, but I'm not sure I've sailed boats that were much more fun than this. You're not going to keep up with a 12 meter, mind you, but you can cram a lot of adventure a few square miles of water if you have an eight-foot sailing dinghy. So here's a boat that's easy to build, rows well, carries a good load, packs into a small space, and you can sail it all day. You can find out more about the Eastport nesting pram at clcboats.com. I'm John Harris.